All right, that was pretty hard. That was, that was pretty good. Pretty good. The following contest is scheduled for a one fall. Introducing first from San Antonio, Texas, the Heartbreak Kid, Sean Michael. Shawn Michaels, representing San Antonio, Texas, is one of the most honored champions in the history of WWE, making his 68th WWE pay-per-view appearance case. Wow. It'll be only the third for Batista. Well, with Shawn Michaels, we all saw what happened in Survivor Batista interfered in the Heartbreak Kids match against Randy Orton and tossed him Shawn Michaels the victory. All right, they're done, so we'll skip this because we've seen it. We haven't seen Batista's old entrance yet, or new, so we haven't. Yeah, we'll watch it. Oh, he has, he has Nate. And being by the Nature Boy, Ric Flair, from Washington D.C. Oh, oh, he's gross. His face is gross. Ew. Oh, that's gross. Oh. Oh, I mean, uh, on, on second thought, it's not, it kind of resembles him, but that's still gross. Oh, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Oh, dude, the lower half of his face. His eyes kind of resemble him, but, like, from his eyes down, it's just, oh, it's disgusting. Oh. Oh. Oh, man, back when he wasn't a walking tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, just, just kidding. I like tattoos, so a lot, a lot of Batista's tattoos are pretty cool. Some of them are weird. He has like a bunch of fucking like the the line of stars going down the side of his abdomen. Like, that's kind of weird for a guy to have, you know. But I mean, a belly button tattoo that's kind of weird to have. But he's had that forever, so. But yeah, no, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of tattoos, so he's good. Am I Batista? No, I'm. I'm Mr. Shawn Michaels. Oh. Yeah. No, mm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a. I'm a 96, bitch. I hope. I'm a 96. You're like an 80, like five. Okay. Oh. Oh, bitch. Mm. You ready for this? If it's tie up, this is about skill oh, oh, and God power. Damn it. I, I kind of want to turn off the chain wrestling because I, I kind of don't like it. But. Ooh. Mmm, look at that. Look at that. Oh, no, that reversal. Oh! Oh, Ref! I'm so sorry! <laughs> ref! Ref! Oh, Ref, I'm so sorry! Ref! Jesus Christ, Ref! Ref, I'm, I'm so sorry, Ref. <laughs> I fucking knocked him out, dude. I fucked up that Ref. At last year's Armageddon, Shawn Michaels entered as a champion. But this year, this match is not about titles. This is simply personal. The courageous Shawn Michaels going up against the monster yeah, known as Batista. Yeah, and it definitely oh, is God, personal, Cole. Why is he reversing all this shit? Batista did do it oh, no. And as for Batista and what he did at Survivor Series, not only will Shawn Michaels never forget... I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stop mentioning that his fucking that chest night. hair is yeah, purple, man. All, Cole, that's not... That's, Austin. like, I don't get it. There we go. This time he didn't reverse it. Mm, yeah, bitch. Can uh, can I do, can I do springboard? Oh, I can. And it didn't work. Oh. 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 Man, this is a nice, a nice match right here. You ready for this? Ready for this? Ready for this, Dave? Ready for this, big Dave? That. What? What? I'm sorry. Uh, hello? But if there is anyone that could intimidate him, it might be Batista. Well, let's face it. Batista could intimidate anybody. Oh, man. He reversed it. But I reversed that. At the same time. Bitch. Batista with his strength and power has the ability to throw Shawn Michaels in a piece of garbage if he gets him in the right position. And believe me, that's exactly what this big monster thinks of Shawn Michaels. A piece of garbage. 
I don't think Batista respects anyone. Let me just beat his head because it's already yellow. I need to get it to orange. That's the orange blow right No, oh man, I knew he was gonna reverse that. And the display by Shawn Michaels. Hopefully, yeah. Yeah, beat his ass. Yeah, beat his ass. Mmm, yeah, now what? Perform the top rope elbow diving. Yeah. Elbow diving. Alright. He's gonna reverse it. And I'm gonna do that. Oh, he's gonna reverse that too. But I'm gonna... No, I'm not gonna reverse it. Oh, shit. Oh, atomic drop. That's not an atomic drop. Is it an atomic drop? I don't know. No, it's like a. Oh, it's like a chair. Something chair. Like a. Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> Raph! Raph, I'm so sorry. Raph. Oh my god, Raph, I am so sorry. <laughs> I fucking leveled the ref like two times. Sweet chin music, motherfucker. Yes. Yeah. Oh man. Oh. Oh, who would have guessed that, right? Oh. Yeah, Rick. Rick Flair getting hyped up. Ooh, yes. Batista. Feeling it, Batista gonna look for the, the patented Batista bomb right here. Oh, oh no. In serious, serious trouble. Low blow. Nope. Now Sean was faced, so he wouldn't do a low blow. Oh, yeah. Looks like it's all over for Sean Michaels here, but wait, no, not yet, not yet. No, oh! Right here's the count. Yes! Awesome! Yo, that's awesome! That was awesome. He just... That purple chest hair. It was a clean sweep for Evolution and Armageddon. Triple H wins back the world title, and Randy Orton wins the Intercontinental title, and Ric Flair and Batista win the tag titles. Batista's model is fucking gross, dude. Look at it. That's fucking. It's gross. It's so gross. On an episode of Raw, Shawn Michaels and Rob Van Dam defeat the team of uh, Batista, Ric Flair, and Triple H. HBK wins Triple H. Pins Triple H during the match during a shot. Triple H is the World Heavyweight title on Raw. Alright. Mm. Up next. Is there anything else, or do I just go into it? Alright, I'll just go into it. Uh, so, no video package before this one, then. Just straight into the entrance? Yeah. Alright. Well, when they're done talking, I'll skip both of these entrances because we've seen them both. The following is scheduled for one fall, and it is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from San Antonio, Texas, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. It's showtime, and here comes the showstopper. He's a four time champion, Shawn Michaels, and tonight, can he become the next heavyweight champion of the world? We remember back to the Royal Rumble 1997 in the Alamo Dome, over 60,000 fans on hand. This is Shawn Michaels regained the championship. That was almost seven years ago, and that was the last time Shawn Michaels has competed for the world championship in his hometown. Well, this huge arena is packed to the rafters, Cole, and every single person is on their feet going nuts. How does it say love Shawn Michaels here in San Antonio? Wasn't wasn't King a heel though? Wasn't King a heel commentator at the time? Why is he why is he praising how they love them here? Cause like if he was a heel, wouldn't wouldn't he have said like, oh no, they're not they're not cheering Shawn Michaels, they're just cheering the, the fact that he gets to wrestle Triple H or some bullshit like that because King's fucking stupid. Um. 
Yeah. But yeah, wouldn't he say something like to put down Sean, not be like, yeah, they love him here. He's awesome here. Everybody loves him here. It's his hometown. They love him. Yay. No. No commentary for Triple H. And from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, he is the world heavyweight champion, Triple H. He is an eight-time world champion, Triple H. And here he comes with Nature Boy Ric Flair, who will be at ringside for the game. Triple H knows what's at stake his whole professional life because the World Heavyweight title means more to that man than anybody I've ever seen. Yeah, but Shawn Michaels will not be psyched out. He is confident. He is ready physically and mentally. Oh, man, after this, we probably get to do the last man standing match at Royal Rumble. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. That was an awesome match. I'm not going to be able to do it justice because it's a, it's a game it is an I can't remember the spots, but, do it. He can become the world heavyweight champion. You're going to you see know. an eruption, the likes of which we've never experienced before. Yeah, you're right. Shawn Michaels' hometown they tore the place down, has got to be so, decisive. Cool There's no way he's going to let these fans down. I've been waiting a long time to see this. This is going to be an amazing The thing match. is, though, Shawn has always had to carry Triple H in their matches. Let's be honest here. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. A capacity crowd out here right, in San Antonio. Right. Sean Michaels yeah, has come friend. home to meet his former oh. best friend. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm getting... Oh, boy. There is oh. electricity in this arena, oh. Cole. Oh. These fans want Sean Michaels oh. to become the world heavyweight oh. champion. Oh, so oh, oh, yeah, beat his ass. Oh. For either of these competitors. They know each other so well. Yeah, my... yeah. oh, no. Wait, yeah. Yeah. Oh, you yeah, fucking piece of shit. You want some of this? You want some of this Triple H? This is for burying Curtis Axel. This is for burying CM Punk. Oh, Jesus. Oh, not do it. And what that championship advantage that we talked about does. Is it puts the referee in a tough yeah. spot because no matter what Triple H um, does here, oh, yeah. the referee mm. no doubt won't want to. No, I got it. No, he, he did not get it. Title. But believe me, Cole, Triple H God doesn't it, want man. to keep his title by being disqualified. He oh, wants to Jesus. prove a point here. He wants to show oh. the world that he is deserving of that world heavyweight championship. Oh yes. He wants to beat Shawn Michaels. Bitch. 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 Oh Jesus, that reversal. God damn it, that was Hey now Damn it. Oh, what an elbow drop. oh, how does he keep reversing this shit, man? There's nothing like competing in a world championship match. God damn I didn't even press it. How is that too fast, man? How does he keep freaking reversing this shit? Well, we know Shawn Michaels has a huge home field advantage, King, but he has got to use his speed and Fuck off, man. too. He can't be lured into a street fight type battle. And that's exactly what Triple H would like to see this match turn into. That should be lightly, yeah. Uh, you know I Michaels show Triple H in the ropes. Anytime, and that's some there we go. Uh -oh. Oh, no. Skin the cat. Oh! What? Triple H set over the top rope, and out Michaels. Oh yeah, there was no ta the table wasn't there, right? Now you can strut HBK. Oh wait a minute! Incoming! No! Oh, this is awesome, Nike. Michaels off the ropes. Down go Triple H and Flair. HBK really being the showstopper right now, stopping the show of the game. Yeah, bitch. Now I'm Triple H. Wow! The Nature Boy, Ric Flair, and Triple H both laying flat on their backs outside the ring, and Shawn Michaels standing tall inside. Ooh, a little showboating going on here. And he gets back in the ring. And Triple oh, H no. with a reversal. And that's because the game has a gift. Oh, uh, no. Do I just have to win now, or...? Oh. There we go. Oh boy, Sean Michaels turned up the man, Cole. Triple H has no idea where he is. 
Did you just say coach or coal? I can't remember. I, I didn't, I wasn't paying attention. I was drinking my, oh, uh, the ref has just been fucked the last, like, month. Oh, the ref's gonna see it. No, he's not. Oh, Jesus. Do I have to kick out? Come on, Shawn Michaels. Told if Michaels can survive this, it'll be a miracle. Yeah. Rolling out of harm's way. Smart strategy. And he's heading back inside the ring. Triple H, please. Bitch. Shawn Michaels doing what he loves to do. Get your shit out of here and let me taunt. You mother... Stay down and let me taunt and regain my stamina, you bitch. He's got him up. Piece of shit. Fuck. Slam. Stay down. And we're going back between the ropes. Oh, look at the emotion. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. Oh, one of the biggest matches of Shawn Michaels' career right. we're witnessing tonight. There's no doubt about it, Cole. Maybe yeah, bitch. the biggest king. You better Shawn stay the fuck down. Be you better stay the fuck the down. Title. Yeah, you well, roll over for this. You roll over. You motherfucker, stay down, man. No, go into the corner, man. Oh my god. send these fans into a frenzy. The fitness and speed of Shawn Michaels is coming to the forefront just oh. like it did the last time these two men Stay two the fuck ago, down. When HBK and Rob Van Dam defeated Triple H, Ric Flair, and Batista yeah. in a handicap tag match. Yeah. yeah, but Shawn Michaels is starting to get Triple H angry. And the one thing you don't want to do is make the game mad. Because that's fuck when he off. is most dangerous. Well, he's not called the cerebral assassin for nothing. Triple H will pull out all the stops to make sure his title doesn't slip away. Yeah, bitch. Come on. This match for the heavyweight championship of the world is the final match on the final Raw of 2003. How could we end it any bigger or better than this, Cole? That's right, King. This is the Jesus. last Just regain my stamina. Just regain it. I'll tell you something. Shawn Michaels is on his game tonight, isn't he? I mean, he has the momentum right now, and if he can sustain it, he'll be the new world heavyweight champion. No doubt about it, King. Another sweet show music? Yeah. Alright, please. Let this be the last one. He reversed it. He fucking reversed it. These thousands of fans can feel it. This entire arena. No, I didn't. Oh, yes. And then look. Sean collapses in exhaustion. And he got it. Sean Michaels is world champion. This is unbelievable. Yeah. Shawn Michaels. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think the official said both men's shoulders were down. It was a tie. Hey, 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 look out. Triple H is still champ. Are you kidding me? Now this fight rages on. And it's Flair now. Set for the ride. Shawn Michaels has got to be living off sweet chin music. <laughs> there you go. Poor ref. A shot to the official. Poor ref. And I got to think that he deserved it. What a <laughs> oh, poor ref. <clears throat>